Do you think your web pages are excluded due to PageWorth redirect issues that you found under Google Search Console under Coverage Report? Then this video is going to help you how to fix the PageWorth redirect issues and best practices in handling PageWorth redirects. If you are new to my channel, I am Ish, search engine marketer and do you need more videos about page speed optimization and how to drive organic traffic for your website, then subscribe to this channel. Let's get into the video. Let us see what are the solutions for page with redirects. Page redirects. If this is not done properly, then this is going to impact your website visibility on search engines and for the user. If you have excessive redirect on your page, on your page that, for example, the page A redirects to page B and page B redirects to page C and so on, or the redirected pages a 404 or 410, then the search engines going to don't want to further proceed and just remove the pages from its index and it just exclude from it. So make sure you ha you have set the page redirect only when the when this is required and it is useful for your user. First check where the URL is located, whether it is within the website or it is from external resources. For this, you can go under the your coverage report and all known pages, whether it is submitted in sitemap or submitted pages. If the URL is listed under the sitemap, then take immediate action to fix the issue. Test the live URL to make sure that how the Google discover the pages, whether it can crawl or it can index the pages. So test the live URL. Let's see how the Google discovered your page, whether it through sitemap or through referring page. And the next step four, now check the crawlability issues, whether the page can be crawlable, yes, whether it's indexable, yes, whether the Google fetched the pages, yes, it's page, the page was fetched successfully, that is 200, okay. So Google can crawl, fetch and index this page, but it is not in Google, it is it got excluded. Okay, let's check why it is excluded. Now let's check the canonical issues, whether the page whether the page is a duplicate page means this is the canonical URL or else Google selected some other URL as a canonical URL because search engines are getting wiser. If you define a wrong URL as a canonical URL, Google can itself select some relevant pages as a Google selected canonical URL. Okay, check the canonical pages and inspect the canonical page. So the step six is inspect the canonical URL. So that URL seems to be okay or that, whether that URL having any issues or not. Most commonly, the canonical URL would have any issues. So you could find the, the pages indexed on Google. Now you have reached the analyzing part. Now you are having three URLs, the page with redirect URL, referring page URL and canonical URL. For example, your page with redirect URL, which is having issue is category job and the page one marketing, query string marketing. And the referring page URL is it is referring from the external domain jobportal.com. And the canonical URL is here. So if you are not getting any traffic from this URL and you are having zero backlinks for this page, for this URL, then uh, there is no point in redirecting this URL to here. So Google has excluded this URL from its index. So in, at this situation, I, I don't going to change anything because I don't want that URL because I'm not getting zero traffic from that URL and there is no links backlinks for this page. So I'm happy what I what I what here it is. So it, depending upon your situation, analyze it. What makes sense for you? 
and choose wisely and make the changes and request indexing again so google will visit the page again and make it index make it on its index so it depends upon your situation so choose wisely so decide what suits for you most commonly clean clean up all the redirects which are not useful that is uh, that has no inbound links and no re zero referral traffic so keep in mind you can you if uh, as much as possible do the uh, redirects only if you have inbound links for that url and having referral traffic from that url so as much as possible avoid the redirects because it increases the loading time and it wastes the crawl budget so as much as possible please avoid the redirects redirecting best practices i would recommend you to redirect as much as possible on server side even though you can redirect on client side i recommend you to do server side because server side redirections are faster than client side redirect um, and if you have any problems on your cms or in plugin then the redirect will be halted so as much as possible uh, avoid the redirect if you if you need it like site migration you should consider server side redirects at even if it the, at the worst case you can do client side redirect and the next thing is redirect only relevant pages please note this redirect only for relevant pages because uh, if the these these are only responsible for soft 404 pages too because if search engines find the page you are redirected is you are you you redirected to is not found in similar then it would consider soft 404 pages so consider only redirecting to relevant pages most commonly uh, webmaster prefer to redirect to home pages even though uh, some pages are not relevant when user visiting your website and they intend to visit some product pages means it's redirecting to home pages it's not it's not a correct thing so avoid redirecting to home pages so redirect to relevant pages and next thing is avoid redirect chains this page redirecting to another and that page redirecting to another and so on so avoid re redirecting chain frequently check the redirection on your web websites and keep up the best practices and that's it from today's video and i hope you find useful information from this video and if you find it useful please like share and give your comments and if you have any queries and you want to know about uh, more about what is page redirection and what type of page redirection you want to use it for a particular task please tell me in the comment section i can do a video for it uh, and see you on the next video until then this is ish